Hello guys, I've got a very exciting video for you. It's going to be a little bit different than what you have seen lately, and obviously we are starting with my face on the screen. Why is that? Well, because I wanted to capture my reaction when I got some very cool news. So in this video, you're going to see a discussion between me and a couple of the folks from the channel Shipwrecked. If you don't know them, it's Pedro and PH. You will hear me talking to them, you won't see them, but you will hear me talking to them and I'll put relevant information in behind me on the screen, as you are probably already seeing, and this information relates to my theory about the Atlas map. That video is doing pretty well. A uh, few thousand people have watched it, and in the comments, as well as on Reddit, where I first proposed the theory, a lot of people disagreed. A lot of people said, no way, that's the map. We got some news for you today, guys. So what I'm going to do is cut to the most important part of my conversation with Pedro and PH. I will link their channel in the description. I'll link them at the end of the video, but this video will actually be long because once I've given you the key information, the key moment from our chat, I'm going to leave the unedited uh, conversation going on in the background. I'll put the trailer playing blurry behind me or something like that. So sit back and watch. Enjoy. If you're digging the maps and the map theory videos, they've been doing all right. Uh, I would love uh, for you to sit back and enjoy this one and uh, go check out the people that I just mentioned link in the description they have one channel they're fantastic and instead of bringing this news to their channel they decided to bring it to me and let me break some news for all of y'all I won't spoil anything but in your face anyone who disagrees with me let's cut to the conversation uh okay so here we go um yep. I <clears throat> so we you know we recently did a video with uh Jade right yep and uh he he did mention that uh that latest map video was a little bit of a, a controversial topic between you two. Oh, uh <laughs> but, yeah we had well yeah. we had we had one video uh where we kind of clashed ideas we ended up coming to terms in case people don't know i made a video of of something that's in the pc gamer article where i was like yeah. boom i think this is the map nobody's talking about it uh, yeah. i'm not gonna lie that video actually kind of blew my mind okay. yeah <laughs> no the, the, well yeah the whole part where you actually line up the grid and everything and then yeah the the north south pole observations oh, yeah. are very, very well thought out um so here's why i didn't come to that conclusion at all when mm -hmm. i first saw the image and i owe an apology to uh specific i can't even remember their name now i'm so sorry you know they specifically they were just like oh that like do you know that the, the actual map has been you know released i'm like no nah, i don't think it has and it's like no like this is like i'm aware of the video that it's not you know like i didn't this, this is before i was even watching it okay i'm mm -hmm. not even gonna lie i did not give you the benefit of the doubt at the yep. start so let me be the first to actually apologize as far as that goes okay and and i'll say this when i i, yeah. I so i made the video before i made yeah. it i've been taking a few of my ideas to reddit to go like, yeah. I did that with the creatures, to be like, what have I missed? What might be out there that I didn't notice? Um, with the map video, I took that idea and went, hey guys, is this the actual map? Reddit eviscerated me. I got downvoted to hell. So I was yeah. like, man, maybe I think a bad idea is good because that can happen. I'm like, I'm gonna get some sleep and worry about this video in the morning. And I woke up to Reddit looking that bad and I was like, man, I, maybe I shouldn't release this video. Maybe it's a stupid idea. <laughs> so you are not alone in thinking it's, it might have been a stupid idea. I also thought that. <laughs> And so after I actually decided to watch the video uh, and, you know, understand like why people were so convinced from it, right, okay. generally speaking, yep. um, it got me pretty convinced as far as, because here's what I was going to do, okay? I, I, I'll be 100% transparent with you. Yep. I was going to debunk your video. I would have loved that. <laughs> I was going to debunk your video because I do, I do graphic design for a living, right? So yep. what I was going to do, I was going to try to find the pattern in the map and then show people how I just flip 25% of the map or whatever into yep. four different ways and bam, there you go. I've recreated the map, the sample map image, right? Right. Now, <laughs> I'll say this. When I was making the video, one of the things yeah. I noticed was like, man, there are some repeating shapes here, <laughs> right? And I was like, man, I could be so wrong. But then, then I had been working on the treasure map, a video yeah. on treasure maps, and I was like, man, the mechanic for treasure maps is basically you get a piece of scrap map and you have to rotate it uh, in order to match it to an island and match the coastline perfectly. And I was like, man, so the devs are going to have the incentive to create similar but distinct islands. So I was like, at this resolution, we can't tell the difference between mm. similar and identical. So that was one thing. And then I also noticed that when I saw repetition, it wasn't like, 
here's a thing in the bottom left, and I'll put some stuff up on the screen if I'm making a video of this. Here's yeah. I didn't see it like, oh, here's this randomly in the bottom left, here's this randomly in the top left. And that yeah. started me thinking more about the globe idea, and I'm like, man, if these are yeah. bands where it's like, there's a, uh, uh, what would you call, uh, what's the word, equator, right? I'm like, okay, yeah. well maybe these islands are together because they're all tropical. So, and, and we covered everything, uh, PH, yeah, you actually got the article before chat even did, right? Yes. Before any of the devs, I don't know what you did, you were just like, I refreshing. think I must have been one of the first people to actually have the article in my hand. Yeah, and so I was sleeping during this time, so PH was doing all the research on it and catching me up and, or catching me up just a, just enough, you get me? Like, that's, that's kind <laughs> of our style, essentially, like, we don't fill each other in on everything because then now there's a lot more room to expand on as far as which is why i'm not feeling i haven't filled you guys in on it yet that's what's oh, gonna yeah. make this, that's what's gonna make this work before you do i'll send a compliment back yeah. to you guys you have a video on uh whatever it's called zevos or whatever where yeah you, where you uh. Uh, just like it's stuff i could never possibly do it was like almost some hacker magic where you were able to pull <laughs> some image that wasn't available by downloading the whole uh, forum right but <laughs> yeah. still not available yeah. and uh and just pulled out this little data where you're like oh here's an image what the heck is this nobody's ever seen this yeah yeah, yeah but, the, but, the, but then all it takes is like one person that's even smarter than that to actually find a direct link to it like in a page <laughs> that actually does show it so that's now out there but it's fine yeah it's one of those things i think what was weird about that uh exchange in general is that the person was he was essentially saying like this isn't a leak this was uh available yesterday i'm just like what is what is your like timeline for like how, how much time do i actually have after it's like <laughs> potentially possible to even have like do i do i not have even a day i need it needs to be out like in the first i need to see it first period yep. you know like people know, are cause... people are kind of the worst man because uh i did that i did that map video and as far as i could tell i'm like i think i'm the first one to, i know i was the first one to bring it on reddit and then and I'm, I'm like, gonna I'm, explain to you yeah. why why yeah. nobody else brought it up though i think i have a good answer for that because you asked right. a question you asked yeah, the yeah. question in your video why but, the, and i will answer it for you but i'll say <laughs> like I, i'm getting comment i got a comment today that this guy yeah. was like oh you're late to this i'm like what I'm, how? Oh, man. <laughs> no, man, no, you're being chilled. You are 100% being chilled. Nobody else has a video like that. Every, okay. Like, uh, I would say for the most part, the other content creators don't really feel like it's a viable yeah. uh, theory necessarily. But so I, I wasn't going to be the one that just like, would just like, you know, zoom and enhance on the actual article and then just read through it for people. Like it wasn't going to, you know how we have let's plays, let's read, you know, I could do Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> <We> just, <laughs> so the, let's no. read the piece to gave like, no, that's not going to happen. Oh, yeah. yeah, I waited um, to make that map thing until I saw someone else, like I think yeah. J Jade had a video breaking down the whole article and showing showing yeah. pictures. I was like, okay, well now it's open open season. Okay, and so yeah. from the original image that PH had in the folder, right, that we have in the like in the Dropbox that we interact mm -hmm. with, or was it like Google Drive? Either way, whatever, same same difference. Um, this is this is the image. I'm gonna show it to you on Discord, so that way you have something where okay. you, I guess to show up on the video. So as you can see, the shapes in this image don't look that distinct. Yeah. You get me? They're not that. And then this is, and then on the PDF, it's even worse. That's the on first the, uh, one I had too. And it wasn't until yeah. I found out someone posted just the map on Reddit. And I was like, oh, wait, that's actually got some definition to it. Yeah. So here's the one. Yeah. Here's the one from the Reddit. Uh, PH, oh, so someone just, actually got like a higher quality. So, somebody, no, somebody scanned it from the, as oh. what I'm thinking. Yeah. So yeah. you see the big difference between that one. Now you actually see colors. <laughs> Yeah. Instead of just like light, yeah. yeah. Yep, yeah. I'm with you. Yeah, my PDF, I, I tried looking at. It, I was like, this, you can't do anything with this. So, yeah, I'm with yeah. you. Yeah, yeah. So that's that's the reason why I didn't believe it because from my perspective, and then, uh, I mean, think about how small it is relative to a, an actual page, right? Mm -hmm. So like somebody really has to take a really good scanner to actually showcase that, or I mean, the level that they're printing at, like the dots, you know, yeah, like the DPI is insane to actually be able to get even that much from that tiny little uh, bit. Shout out to that guy on Reddit who posted just the map because uh, that's that's when I started theorizing, right? Yeah, no, and that's 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 the part that made complete sense to me, honestly, like the whole North South Pole thing. It's per it's perfectly lined up for that. That yeah. so that thing, the the snow islands at the top and bottom. Yeah. I didn't think of that. Uh, I posted my five reasons that I thought it might be on Reddit, and then that yeah. was one of the first replies was, "Oh, have you noticed?" And so I added yeah. that to my Reddit post. So yeah, 
that's no, that's it, it, it only the community out. helped me come up with the theory so no yeah it goes without saying that the community is massive as far as that goes and i think me and you or mm -hmm. us as content creators you know uh we we hope that they do that like we want to be filled in as much oh, yeah. as possible so it's not a bad thing at all it's not something that we're going to be stingy about <laughs> like <laughs> at all whatsoever <laughs> it's not something that uh we're not going to be okay with uh you know like we're going to be okay with giving credit where it's due so it's not that big of a deal so anyways i reached out to the the author of the article so anyways i reached out to the the author of the article yep i think uh, on twitter philippa war twitter. is that her name yeah yep. and i actually and i actually asked the question i said hey do you by any chance know if the map displayed on your pc gamer article is the actual atlas map or just a placeholder she responds with it's the map of atlas world as it looked when the article was written but the game is in active development so i couldn't tell you how accurate it is now word so it is it is the official map that's it what they got the they just wow, okay. they just decided to only have it as a tiny image in so. your face everybody <laughs> <laughs> take a breath Take wow. a breather. Confirmed. 100% confirmed. That is the actual map. This is information that we would not, we will not get from the devs because they're so, they're so stingy about what they're releasing. The only things that we're getting from the images are things that we can kind of just say they imported from Ark. They haven't, they haven't actually showcased too much that's actually exclusive to Atlas. And I think it's because they're trying to hold that for, uh, for the game release. So yeah. all, we're, all we're getting are things. And the, the problem with that though, is that the only thing people care about <laughs> mainly is the atlas exclusive stuff and so uh so even even now we're starting to get comments of like uh, is, is this image really newsworthy and stuff like that and it's like well kind of but then kind of not like i understand what you're saying but that this is all they're giving us yeah so I, I can't do anything but but just you know spec uh, speculate on what they actually show us no so, I, i've had some videos <laughs> i've done a few videos lately a few of them are doing well but i am realizing yeah. i'm getting to a point i can't just <laughs> keep keep giving people the information that already exists like the videos yeah. are great for people who who aren't you know i can't, don't know another phrase for this but aren't balls deep in this like we are that yeah. that they can't they're not reading it they're not consuming it constantly so i've made a few videos exploration creatures whatever for people yeah. you know they got 11 minutes they get a little here's how it's gonna work but yeah. i can tell the hardcore fans are like give us something new where's the new gameplay i'm like i got nothing yeah, it's no, almost like being the devs at this point. Like <clears throat> everyone keeps like hounding you. Like, have you got any new videos? Yeah. yeah. What's the new content? It's like we've got as much content as everyone else, really. Yeah. As yeah. far as like images being released. And I don't, I don't have leaks or hacks or insider connections, so I'm just taking what's out there, <laughs> trying to research and condense it. But I mean, yeah, or yeah. theorize. So uh, since this is now confirmed, that is actually yes. the map. Yeah. Um, I did a live stream. Or at least was the map in, was at the one map. point. But, Which, but I, I definitely don't think they changed it up too much. No, I said that in my video too. Like, if this yeah. is the correct one, it's potential it's changed because I bet it's been weeks in the process of making the article, right? Well, it's um, because we're in early access, so it doesn't it, it doesn't have to be finished for you mm -hmm. know for them to keep working on it. That's the thing; they could just keep going. Yeah. It's not, yeah. Now, um, I did a theory live stream today where I took this map. And yeah. I, I used Photoshop. Photoshop has like, uh, you know, an extrapolation tool, right? Where you can you can select a little chunk of, like once, basically once I removed all the paper from the outside of the map, I could yeah. highlight the word Atlas at the bottom, the word Arc in the middle, and, um, uh, and basically Photoshop will fill it in with something that resembles the other islands that are out there. So I did that until, yeah, beautiful. So I did that until I had uh, basically just a blue map. And, uh, and then I guess people, you said people were doing this on the Discord today before I did my live stream. So somebody yeah. ca basically continued the theory of going, okay, if this is the map, what else can we figure out about it? And my next theory was maybe, you know, if we've got North Pole, South Pole, maybe it's going to be on a globe. And if it's on a globe, you know, that's how it'll be represented for players. I don't think the world will actually be rendered in, in as a sphere or anything like yeah, that. That's that's one that's one yeah, that's one thing that whenever people because they all they do is specifically tie into the word globe in the Steam descriptions and stuff yep. like that, right? Yep. And so it's like that's not enough confirmation because I can't even get Rob to confirm that his name is Rob. And so <laughs> 
<laughs> like yeah. he's, he's, giving, he's giving me nothing here yeah um but I, I think i think you're correct i think the more likely outcome is that you're going to get to the edge of the map and then it's going to be something that's going to allow you to just essentially get to the other end of it from east, the other side. east west will work that way and then i think yeah. the poles basically as you go off the top of the map you'll come in somewhere else on the top of the map so people yeah. people watching this can go check out me basically i do the whole work from that high def yeah. map that we we showed earlier to yeah. the a globe, you know, and I cut and paste it, and then I added grid lines, and clearly someone else was thinking the same thing, um, yeah. but didn't do it as a video, I don't think, and then added the grid lines, and then put used a software to put it on a globe, and I think one of the most convincing parts of that is that when you do that, the east and the west side of the map seem to perfectly line up. Like the, 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 the background pattern, yeah. Yeah, basically. So I didn't do this in my live stream, but I'll, I'll put it up on the screen as I do this video. But basically, yeah. you know, I'll match up without without the globe, without twisting and, and you know, bending things around. You yeah. can almost perfectly match things up. And because we have this water that isn't just blue, it's got a sort of underwater topography to it. There's yeah. details that you can kind of line up, and even doing the globe, it almost worked perfectly. So I already know where the secret artifact caves are, to be honest. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you, can just, you can just kind of tell, yeah. Yeah. Uh, well, mean, there's yeah. giant islands that are probably going to be free ports and things like that. Um, but yeah. yeah, there's it's 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 pretty cool, man. Uh, I'm if if all this stuff turns out to be true, and theory one now proved true, this is the map. Theory mm -hmm. two, the world is borderless and will be represented as a globe. Which I mean, if you look at the logo, right? It's a spinning planet with the, you know, atlas in front of it. Like, yeah. I don't, you know, it feels like they're going to do that for us. Um, one of the things about Ark, right, you get to the edge of the map, there's this invisible energy barrier that stops you from going anywhere. I feel yeah. like with this massive world, they're not just going to have a big square world with an energy no, border. I, 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 think it's, I think it's going to TP you to the other side of it. Or yeah. Something. yeah, yeah. So, um, so, you know, if that's all true, this is so crazy ambitious, like... Uh, yeah. And I know the devs, no matter what they do, and especially, it seems crazy to me to release this game on Xbox within like a few months. Uh, yeah. Like, like it's just going to make people hate them because it can't well, possibly run amazing. It's going to be tough to run it amazing on PC. But yeah. um, all, all of this stuff, if it's all true that we get a globe and it's borderless, man, this game is so yeah. ambitious. Yeah, I mean, it's going to be the same thing that they did with Ark. It's, uh, you know, they're going to tell people on Xbox that they have to understand that it's early access. and But that's what they want. They want to deal with those road bumps, you know, because we have PS4 people going, hey, where, where's yeah. my early access glitch fest? You know, I want I want some of that. Yeah, um, yeah. I, looking at the map, there's actually, like, one thing that I actually think stands out to me, and I don't know... It's probably nothing, but these, I'll just put the image in here. Um, the two parts that I've circled, they're almost identical. Right. Yeah. And they're yeah. almost like a target, kind of like a crosshair kind of looking thing. Yeah. yeah. So those are a couple of the ones that made me sketch out about my theory until I started thinking about the way that the treasure maps work. Because if you look in the polar biomes, uh, you find mm. the same, si very similar shape. Obviously, we can't tell it whatever how many pixels these islands are like 20 pixels across for the yeah. big islands um there's very similar shapes that are rotated so i mean i think I, I i don't know like what do you think we're seeing with those two it's basically like four boomerang shapes with the curves all yeah. pointing to the middle and they repeat on either side of the map which would basically once you put that on a globe those two spots would basically be opposite each other it could, it could be it could be two separate spawns for the big boss creature that they showed right uh which th i mean that way yeah that way two separate companies could actually face off against the big boss oh uh, yeah at, at the end you know that way it doesn't actually get in the way because i mean i have to imagine that thing takes up quite a bit of space and they'd want to make sure that there's kind of like an established bubble around it that's yeah. my personal theory well, on it. it definitely looks like the areas that they want you to actually go to if this is the map they mm -hmm. look like significant almost like pointing yeah. to these spots yeah we are important island right right of passage yeah. kind of thing yeah yeah it does one of the things that's interesting if this like you know this is now the map one of the things yeah. that is it is interesting is that it does seem like the 
uh, biomes are going to be in regions. So yeah. I played yeah. uh, Islands. I don't know if you guys ever played that game. You basically sail and you'd randomly get a snow island or you randomly get a desert island and there'd only be seven or 12 in the world, right? But in yeah. this, you know, if you sail to the snow biome, it's going to be snow island after snow island, iceberg after iceberg. You're not going to yeah. be able to quickly get from the middle of that area into, you know, some tropical paradise. Right. Yeah, it's, it's, it's an actual risk. Yeah, especially with how massive it is, how long it's going to take you to get out of there. You, you have to go in there really, really prepared. It isn't just like, yeah, it the, isn't just like art. The one clip we have from the trailer of Snow Biome, you know, the one with the people harpooning the whale or whatever. Yeah, yeah, they, yeah and the shipwrecks in the back. And... It's the only time you see like fur and actually warm clothing. Everybody yeah. on that boat has like seal skin and, and hats and stuff you don't see in the other clips of trailer or, or anything. Yeah, yeah, it's purposely formed armor that they appear to be wearing. Yeah. They, they have described four regions in tr in the screenshots and stuff. We've uh, seen reference to jungle islands, to a tropical region, uh, to a temperate zone, and obviously they haven't mentioned it, but there is obviously an ice polar region, right? So yeah. as far as I can tell, what we'll get is a band across the middle that will have tropical and I assume jungle probably some desert islands. I would think we would get that biome somewhere in the world. Um, and then I think there would be bands to the north and south of that that would be kind of, you know, line up with, you know, North America, Europe on a map and give you the temperate, uh, mm. or on a globe, would give you the temperate, you know, uh, pine trees and rocky mountains. And then beyond that, we'll get snow. Um, and I'm guessing jungle will fit right in the middle with the tropical stuff. But yeah, yeah. Th they seem like they're going to be grouped like that. It's going to be very cool. Yeah, they actually, it is nice to see the amount of bracelet that went into the game. They really do want to make you feel like you're actually in a viable world, Man. which is very, very interesting. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Well, that, I mean, I think, I think we've covered the basics. We could probably blab about this stuff forever, but um, what, <laughs> yeah. I, what I'll probably do is like, I'll edit this up and, and put that important chunk at the beginning and then I'll tell people stay tuned if you just want to hear us talk for 22 minutes or however long we talked. But, um, yeah, okay. but yeah, yeah I it, was, I mean, it was a good talk. I think we covered all the essentials and you guys, instead of just making a video on your channel, you figured since I already have a couple map videos going, yeah, come to me, we do a chat and let me turn this into a video. Yeah. So we've got yeah. pa Pedro and PH, the channel is shipwrecked. Um, and I'll put up a playlist. You guys are doing a ton of Atlas preview stuff, just like me. Um, what else should you tell people about the channel? The kind of unique concept is that you're co-op, right? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. We're pretty much co-op. Um, I mean, outside of just covering everything, I guess people would, they would associate our content with kind of like podcast-esque sometimes as far as the discussion videos. Yeah, Even like, yeah. Some, we do upload a lot of LP content. Yeah, you'll do yeah. like whatever, 15 minute long chatting about what's going on in the game world. It'll usually yeah. contain some important information. And, yeah. uh, you know, like, yeah, it's, I don't know. You make amazing looking thumbnails too. So, um, <laughs> yeah, they're my favorite. <laughs> Thank you so much for having us, man. Big man, deal, honestly. Thank you for bringing me the the exclusive scoop. I am right <laughs> in your face, everybody. Um, when Atlas comes out, what are you guys going to be doing? What should people expect? It's going to be no life in it on Twitch. Oh, yeah. 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 Okay. Cool. Gonna, we were setting everything aside just to make sure that we do I, nothing but that for a while. I can't link to Twitch like on the screen, but I'll link to Twitch in the description for people too. So. All right. Um, sounds good. Yeah, that's it. I am not sure when I am going to cut our conversation, but I wanted to take a moment and thank you for checking out the video. Links are popping up on your screen right now for the channel Shipwrecked. Just like me, they have been covering Atlas, previewing it, and doing all kinds of great content. So there's a link to subscribe to their channel. There is also a link to a playlist of their best Atlas stuff. Click on it. Go check it out. I'll also link the map video and the round earth conspiracy theory video, which is really the far end of my conspiracy theory thinking, and we won't be doing any more map coverage. I have some awesome content coming for you, a preview on ships and how they work, so be ready to check that out. But please, right now, check out Shipwrecked and their content. Thank you for watching.